Shalom, greetings, it's your brother YC Bay, and we are Sham Stoppers. Uh, fellas, it's going to be a good video. I'm going to try to read this article, Longview News. We're supposed to go in a pandemic, but these bitches still want some money. They out here prostituting on fans only. We, I'm going to give you some goddamn encouragement today. But first, we reserve our rights and waive none. We're going to give you something the church will dare not do. All right? Fellas, if your bitch cheat on you, your baby mama, whoever you want to call a hoe, right? If she so-called, a.k.a. cheat on you, but if she go get some more cock, right? Make her bring that money in from that dude. Because guess what? Y'all can no longer have a sexual relationship. Okay, you have an employee manager relationship. So the title of this video is called Don't Get Emotional, Get Rich Off This Bitch. Because guess what, fellas, at the end of the day, what you have on this screen right here, these hoes is getting rich off of your ass, right? And they're fucking off of your dime. See, weak niggas can't come out here like that and talk like this because they never done this before. Okay? And guess what? This business is a no contact sport. All right? Stop getting emotional about what a bitch does. These bitches don't get emotional about what she do. They shaking their ass, getting paid, getting y'all stimulus checks and all this old silly ass shit. I ain't getting no stimulus check because I ain't worked in 2013. So my baby mamas ain't getting shit from me. Okay? So, but if they come back, guess what? They going to go get some money from them niggas and bring it back home to dad dad. All right? Fellas, when you get rid of those emotions, you can conquer the world. All right? You got bitches out here on fans only, making money, shaking their ass, got children, don't even fucking care, nigga. Long as she bringing that money because the bitches know it's about survival. I don't know you niggas got to get out of this love shit with mama told you, what your mammy told you. You know what I mean? And when she didn't tell you, your mama should have told you about it. Real talk. Where in the Bible say a man supposed to provide everything for the woman? Show me that scripture where you supposed to provide, you supposed to pay all the motherfucking bills. Huh? Only thing you're supposed to be doing, fellas, is protecting. That is your job. That is your duty. That's it. But taking care of somebody else while they're not in your possession? I'm talking about because somebody else felt that way and that's their fucking opinion? Through a fucking court, nigga, please. Opinions are like assholes. Everyone has one. You should be getting rich. You should be being selfish right now. You should be spending your money on your fucking self. Because guess what? That bitch, she, her job, her legal duty, and her natural duty is to support them fucking children. Because guess what? You gave out that gift to her and they slipped through her fucking crouch. That's just like if you got on your fucking pair of shoes right now. Do I have a duty to clean them motherfuckers? I don't wear them now, nah, nigga. You do. Just like you got on them clothes, them drawers. You hop in your ride. You don't have no fucking legal duty to take care of somebody outside of your fucking crib. Your possession. With several in your possession, you have the duty to take care of. The word legal shit was made up to motherfucking finesse you out of your inheritance, a.k.a. legacy. You can learn all the motherfucking laws in these books because if you don't know the law of nature, 
you going to be taken advantage of. You're going to get raped, butt fucked, and royally fucked by these hoes and they motherfucking pimps. The AKA agency. Because guess what, fella? Truth be told, she ran her ass down there. Fellas, don't get emotional. Get rich. Real talk. Because you are who you follow. You are who you listen to. So if you listen to weak niggas on YouTube, guess what? You a weak ass nigga. Real talk. If you listen to niggas who call the police, you a pussy ass nigga. Real talk. Remember that shit. Because I ain't call the police on now, nigga, and ain't. Because I can fight my own motherfucking battles. So, fellas, wake the fuck up. Stop getting emotional. Because emotions don't pay your bills. Get rich, nigga. Told you to go get a truck. Haul some shit. You know what I mean? It's people need work done. Motherfuckers is lazy out here. So, I'm going to come with a podcast this weekend. It's going to be a blast. Hit us up. Peace. Stop and, and, and stop being a bitch.